What about John Tenta in a Santa outfit? Would Be you, impressive. Would you, would you hang it on a tree? Probably. At that one in Rockefeller might hold it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> big, just fucking, that. A, big fucking, it's a big fucking dude, man. Um, yeah, and a little Christmas gift to our uh, ad-free show subscribers. They are watching us in a live audience setting today. So if anybody out there sees some comments popping up here, that is our live studio audience. Like uh, like the old days, like I love Lucy. Hey, hey Lucy. And I probably can't do that accent. There. The Mandy Rose menu. Looking at earlier, that would be that would be on the Nash menu. Is that what we? Is that where that that came from? The what's that? that the uh, the twenty five dollars. I thought it was John Tentis. He'd have to charge a lot more than twenty five. Mm. I'll tell you. I like to see him in like a like a maybe like a assless chaps. Well, if if you <laughs> do the t well, I was gonna say tugboat though. He wasn't tug he was earthquake. No, nah, he was quake, man. Yeah. <clears throat> Big Fred was was tugboat. Big Fred Ottman, exactly. Well, what you know great, what? Fuck he's that. a he's a great fucker. He's a good guy. And and great and if guy. Eric's gonna try and and nail that number with John Tenta, maybe we should do it with Ottman next week. We'll do the Fred Ottman show and pit those two against each other and see what rating we draw. Um with a full, with the full out Fred Ottman main topic discussion, it can happen. Um, and I'm wearing the uh, the sailor cap for it as well. Um, guys, Sweet. not everyone uses nicotine, okay? But if you do, you'll want to listen up, okay? Get ready. Zoa Lopez, one of our um, live audience attendees, and you too out there can be a live audience attendee. We're gonna do these. Periodically, go to adfreeshows.com and uh, sign up and see how you can be part of the bonus content, not just of our show, not just of our show, but but if if Eric Bischoff is going to do some extra stuff, if he's going to show those photos of uh, John Tenta and the goat, it's probably going to happen on an ad-free show. Uh, Zoel asks, uh, looking forward to seeing you in Kansas City at Planet Comic Con in 2023. That said, what's your favorite type of barbecue? Uh, Kansas City's uh, little dry rub's good. I would, I would put Kansas City up there with 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 with. with there used to be a place in Kansas City that we used to go to. Uh, it was on a it was on a corner. God, I can't remember, but it was like one of the like, that was one of the places where. Like we always ate there, me and Luger always ate there. That was like the only time I could get Luger to eat pork. Uh, Thomas Johnson, great show today, guys. I've been listening since day one. Can't wait for the live show. Fuck Rogan. Click this holds the title. I don't know about you. that. Uh, loose. When, when, I, when I get that same every two week check he does, I'll I'll tip my hat. <laughs> I don't want to do. I, I, I've asked this before. Is the is the guests? Is that the magic of the Rogan show? Just he he does have good guests. Like I've watched, like a cross section, a good cross section of guests. Yeah, they're too long for me. Yeah, well, it depends who it is. Like I could listen to David Lee Roth talk for three hours, and I think he did on that show. Yeah, I I, I don't know. I, I I'm a I'm about a two hour person. Yeah, I, I want to bail at two hours. Yeah, that's why we keep it under two, right? I don't know. There's we some we, tr we try. Some, some weeks we've just rolled on two yeah. and a half hours or whatever. But, uh, loose can. Just don't get me on John Tenna. Hakeem, that we that we deem uh, uh, worthy of the Harley race. So looking for maybe a smoker, perhaps. Looks like he maybe rubbed his eyes with John Tenta's balls. Somewhere on the south side of Asia. Mm, they'd be tearing. Mm. This just the sweat, the funk. Um, stiff one of the year. We'll go through our stiff ones and see which wins the uh the stiff one of the year. Best impersonation by uh, Kevin or myself. The Uniondale, New York 
bunkhouse match of the year. So, so obviously, obviously, you know, you have a match. Yes. I, I know. I'm sure it's all not going to be, you know, walking around in spandex and, and boots for since 11 o'clock that, mor- that morning for no reason. A cyborg and an Asian walk into a bar. Um, no, John, but, John Tenta is the bartender. John Tenta, an Asian and a cyborg walk into a bar. Finish that, guys, for next week. So we'll we'll give a prize to the best the best finish to that joke. Um, but the peeking around the corner thing, the peeking through the door, whatever was being discussed by the town by the wrestlers that we were kind of peeking in on, that suddenly made everything uh, that opened things up. Because you could have anything happen. David Van Bogelen patiently waiting for his fourth question to be asked. Uh, a fight breaks out. Which of these men are the last standing? Harley Race, Dick Slater, Carl Gotch, or John Tenta? In their primes, of course. If it's at a Denny's, I'm going with Tenta. Hmm. I tell you what, man, I, I I can't see anybody knocking Harley Race the fuck out. Yeah, I was gonna say it's it's probably got to be Harley too. Oh, you do hear about Dick. Who else do you hear about? Tracy Smothers, right? Haku. Those are kind of the common ones. But from that list, from what I know, it's got to be Harley, right? He has a good grip. Grab my I, balls one night. I tell you right now, I've I, I've talked to Flair, and Flair had they. You know, if you, if Haku's not on that list, then then it's the next one is 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 Harley. There you go. Oh, and then finally we'll round it out with Michael Pro Pro. I'm gonna mess this name up. 